Hello everybody, welcome back to another Bryce Pitts 01 video. Today we're going to be opening up the old Target exclusive, and I got it at uh, Target of course. As you can see, it's so funny that you can't see that. I might have to move the camera or fix the little tripod that it's on here to get the whole entire box. Because I'm just trying to, you know, get all of this as possible. But I know it's, but I know it's supposed to be showing the, uh, well this guy so anyways he was uh for, for about a good price for uh sammy Guevara for uh i don't know on clarence very nice and here's a picture of him on the back when he's a tnt champion so uh good picture i gotta say it is um let's just open him up and see what he's all about and here he is out of his packaging wait why is there a second one oh yeah Silly me, I bought an extra one because I thought I didn't got Sammy Guevara, but I did anyway. So I'm actually doing the um, Clarence version instead of the regular version that doesn't have the, uh, well, the sticker. And also I will be using this for the thumbnail, so <laughs> just to make things more tricky on you. But just remember, I got it from this, not this. So just to let you know. Anyways, I might save this or get, sell it or something. I don't know. Or maybe if I meet old Sammy Guevara in person, that would be absolutely epic. And maybe this time he'll put me on the blog. That's right. I'm calling you out, Thunder Rosa. So just kidding. No hard feelings. It's, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. But add me on the next vlog next time. But I know Sammy Guevara will. I know he will not edit me out. Ed edit me out. But anyways, let's review this figure. And uh, since he's out his packaging... Uh, let's, uh, let's move him around, see what he's all about. Alright, everybody, here he is, Sammy Guevara, having his tongue sticking out. So, uh, I know we have another Sammy Guevara. Um, he's going to be in the Unmet Series 5 in his prison suit, so stay tuned for that one. So, of course, you're going to get the exact same head sculpt from the original, from the Unrivaled Series Sammy Guevara. That I'm pretty sure I have already re already reviewed on the channel. So if you guys haven't checked that out, go check it out. So anyways, you get the same head sculpt, but however, you get a different brand new attire. So this is interesting. So let's give the old attire a look, shall we? So it's kind of giving it like the Halloween vibes, but this time it's all about spiders. I don't want to call it the Spider-Man attire because it wouldn't make any sense. Because I don't know, maybe if you had like, I don't know maybe like a quote from Spider-Man, then it would make a lot of sense, but it's just a plain old um, Halloween attire. Boy, if you want to pretend it's a Spider-Man attire, I mean, you can, but of course you have the little Panda Illuminati thing going on. I don't know why he wants to do that to... I don't know why. I, that's not my thing, but if that's your thing, go for it, I guess. But don't encourage other people to do it unless they want to, but you know, it's cool, it's cool. But anyways, you have him on the mic... You know, he's going, blah, 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 or I'm better than you. And, and then, of course, you have this one little issue. Just tiny one issue, that's all. Look at the tongue. It isn't filled in all the way. Ain't that a shame? Ain't that a shame? But on this side, this one, you know, pretty average. This one, not so much. I don't know my other figure that has this tongue problem. I highly doubt it. But this is what he looks like without his, uh, his shade, his shades. So... Of course, you come with another TNT Championship, which, you know, hey, nothing can go wrong with the old TNT Championship. I would love to see an AEW United States Championship, just because, you know, I'll, you know, you gotta show your wrestlers that they're fully patriotic and whatnot, you know, show, you know, your love to America. So that's all I'm saying. I would love to see that. Same thing for the women. I would love to see a man and women's United States Championship AEW version, so that'll be kind of cool. So if you don't want it, or wrapped around his waist, if you just want it on his shoulders, you can do it just like that. But anyways, we gotta review the figure, of course. So, here's the mic that he get every single time with this championship out of the way. It does come with interchangeable hands. Let's begin with this figure. So, as you can see, his arms go up and down. Up and down, as usual. Hold on. Up and down. Double jointed elbows, which you gotta love to see that. You gotta love, you gotta love to see that. And then you have some arm swivel which which is so perfect it's like it doesn't get it doesn't like it's stuck 
which I'm glad like they, this part is staying on, which I love. Because like when you do it with a WWE Elite action figure, it gets stuck, which I absolutely hate, but you know, that's alright. Um, kind of get the exact same ripped torso, and then if you put your thumb right here, you can feel like his abs are moving, even though they're just, even though it's just like the rubber part of the torso of the, the figure of the body that's making it feel like it's real, but it isn't. Just, you know, you can use your imagination, you know, do whatever, don't go too crazy with it. Um, you can kick pretty, pretty good for the most part, double jointed knees as usual, and, uh, you can bend his knee as well. Uh, you can also move this part. You can call this one like the hip swivel, if you will. Because you know his hips and his front other stuff are right there. So, boot rotations, you know, fantastic. You know, nothing can go wrong with, you know, the boots. Now, the moment of truth, though, however, can we please, and I mean, can we just please get angle pivot? That's all I'm asking. Just some plain angle pivots. So, let's see if we can get some angle pivots up in here. Nothing. <sighs> Come on, Wicked Cool Toys. Don't be screwing around with me. If I'm asking for ankle pivots, you give me ankle pivots. you got to give the people what they want. Wait, hold on. Let's see. Okay. This one might be a close call. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know what to say on that one. I'm going to have to leave that one up to the comments and say, was that a good ankle pivot or was that, was that just, was that a bust? Because all I'm getting is this. I'm not getting, like, the wiggle part. All I'm getting is this. So, I don't know. That's a tough call. That's a tough call. It is. And then, of course, you have the interchangeable hand. So, let's just say if you want Sammy Guevara to do like a, some like flexing pose that he does every time when he goes to a WrestleCon or he's getting his action figure signed. And uh, even though I do have an extra figure, too, if you know what I'm saying. So, maybe I'll get this one signed. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Oh, I can't wait to predict myself right. If I don't, then hey, at least I'm doing something right. Because if I if I if I if I'm not, then uh, there we go. Jeez, that was kind of giving me a hard time. Uh, what was I saying? Let me think about it. After I get this hand pushed in there, boom. All right. Uh, yes. If I ever meet Sammy Guevara at WrestleCon. He would sound like a cool guy to talk to. I mean, I mean, obviously he's a Houston, Texas, so I'm kind of used to Texan people. Te people from Texas are all right. You know, they're not difficult people. They're they're decent people. That's what I like about them. And then there you go. Look at look, look at him. Look at the Spanish god, Sammy Guevara. Sammy Guevara. I'm Sammy Guevara. I ain't I ain't Canadian. But anyways, you know you can you know you can. Dude, you could do something goofy like this, like he's about to like fight somebody, and then like you can like change the expression, and go, oh no, kind of like the part when uh, I know this is gonna be a funny reference, but remember that part when uh, good old Matt Hardy from you know Matt and Jeff Hardy, the Hardy Boys, or like, well it was just well it was him before you know Jeff Hardy joined, he basically ran him over with a golf cart crazy oh and by the way are we still gonna get the golf cart sammy i'm still waiting where where, where 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 is it at like pull up man like where are we going to get our sammy Zayn action figure with a golf cart oh and by the way what about the the best friend's uh mom van what about trent's mom don't leave his mom out of this conversation okay we need that we totally need that no doubt of that. no doubt about it i'm just saying i'm just saying uh well Okay, I'm going to say that this figure is going to get a, this one's going to get a 9 out of 10. I'm sorry. Like, the angle pivots are kind of disappointing. you got to add angle pivots to every single action figure that I'm going to collect. If I'm going to collect some AEW unmatched or unrivaled figures, you got to add angle pivots. No matter if it's on a big wrestler or a small wrestler, it doesn't matter. Just keep the figure decent. And this figure is, but I'm just saying, just you got to add... That's just a honest. That's just a little problem that Wiki Cool Toys are having at the moment. So I don't hate the product. I love the product. I, I love collecting action figures because that's what I basically do. And I'm not going to treat this as a, a living because let's face it, I just kind of do it just for fun. And I'm doing it because it's a fun thing to do. Everyone has got to know that. 
Anyways, I think that's about it for this review. And uh, again, this figure right here is a solid 9 out of 10. And the attire looks great. It's a great Halloween attire. It's just, I mean, it's a plain Jane attire. I mean, you can basically use this for whatever. You can use it as a Spider-Man attire. It doesn't matter. So I can't wait to do some sick stop motion with this figure and all that kind of good stuff and do some sick dream matches. I'm not sure what they might be, but just stay tuned to find out. You'll be surprised. But um, I'll see you guys next time. You guys rock. Make sure you like and comment, subscribe. Keep it cool in the neighborhood and whatnot. And uh, I'll see you all later. Peace out.